I visited Joann's recently. I got some fabrics, some new things that I want to try out this month. And then they had the, um, the McCall's $1.99 pattern sale and I picked up a few of them. So I'm just going to go ahead and share that with you guys. So get comfortable, do what you got to do and let's dive into the video. So I decided to go ahead and start with the fabric first. I have the receipt here so I can tell you guys how much each thing costs and then we can jump right into the pattern. So, you know, fall is fast approaching. So I decided to get this, um, I decided to get this plaid fabric. I'm gonna see if I can do like a collage and close up of the fabric. So I am thinking for this one, I want to make like a button down, but a crop button down. I'm not sure if I am going to hem the bottom or if I'm going to leave it kind of like rugged. I think, I think I'm going to go with a rugged look, make a crop um, with probably some black buttons, like some big black buttons with the collar long sleeve and I could wear that with a dress. Or either some black leather shorts. I don't know, but I am excited about diving into this one. I think this is the first one that I am going to um I'm going to dive into. I got a yard and a half, and it was only eleven ninety nine because it was a thirty percent off sale. So if you are looking for any plaid fabric, then um make sure you run to Joanne's the fabric. I have. Here is this tie-dye mesh fabric is very stretchy I'm gonna do the close-up so you guys can see the stretch um for this one I already have a shirt that's similar I'll try to put it somewhere on the screen so when I saw this one I'm like I think I need to trace that pattern and redo it myself so if you guys would like to see how I make a pattern of something that I already have then make sure that you guys subscribe and look out for that video because I am going to self-draw this pattern. It's going to be like a turtle leg with a long sleeve. It's kind of see-through. Oh, for the fun part, you guys. I say fun part because I've never made like a jeans pants from scratch. I've always done like um, transformations from things that I've picked up in a thrift store. But I think it's time that I dive in and make my own pair of jeans pants or jeans um, shorts. What do you guys think? Yeah, I'm going to push myself. So I picked up this denim um, fabric from Joann's as well. I am so excited. I want to make some pants with this one. Um, I'm trying to find like a good pattern right now that I can use. I don't want to do self-drafted. I don't want to mess it up i want to make my first pair from a pattern first and then maybe i can self-draft later on so if you guys know of any good patterns to make some pants or some shorts um go ahead and leave that in the comment um this one was i got two yard i got two yards and the price was 20.99 it was also 25 percent off um, so got this very, um, pretty orange, pink, and yellow denim fabric as well. For these, I think I'm making, um, some shorts. When you open it up, the orange on this side is a little bit brighter. Yeah. This is going to be a fun, exciting pattern. I think I'm going to do shorts, not pants with this one. I'm not sure yet, but... I'm still on the hunt for a pattern. So I only got one yard of that one and it was on sale. I got it for $17.99. Those are my four different um, fabric that I picked up in Joann's and I'm excited to work on those this month. Stay tuned. Make sure you subscribe. I picked up a total of eight patterns. They were all on sale for $1.99. So, less than $20. This one um, is the McCall MA213. It's this dress right here. I think I'm going to use this to make like, um, since it's not summer anymore, I'm thinking more like a house dress. Something to like lounge um, around with. I think I'm going to play around with some old fabric that I thrifted. 
and that's probably what I'm gonna do with this one moving on to Mikkel's M8194 this is a button-down um, long sleeve dress I'm excited to do this one especially for the fall um you can do either the short sleeve or the long sleeve short dress or long dress I am thinking more um, for my first make I'm probably going to do the long sleeve long dress especially that fall is coming um, up and then of course I'm gonna style it as probably like a um, like a sweater or a kimono that I'm gonna wear as a dress I'm gonna play around with it so so the other fabric I picked up is the um, McCall 58175. This is what it looks like. I am definitely going to do the shorter version. Okay, so I have this red fabric um, that I picked up from Walmart. I am thinking I'm probably going to use that for this dress. I don't know yet, so don't quote me. <laughs> don't quote me, but... I am thinking about it. Let's see. But I'm excited to do this one soon as well. This one is the McCall R11545. This is what it looks like. I am more of the C option um, and definitely a little bit shorter. As you guys can see, I am more of um, a shorter dress kind of girl so most of these patterns I like the style but I may or may not hack it um so that it can fit my preference um and that's the beauty of sewing making what you want to make to wear so um not sure what fabric I would use for this one yet but yeah this one's gonna be this one's gonna be good the next one is this jumpsuit and I think there's an option right here to do like a dress. Um, I think I'm going to do the dress version and then right here it has the string to make it kind of like um, gather at, at the top. I think I like that. I think I like that option. I didn't even realize that until then. I was looking at this pattern last night and I'm like alright yeah I'm going to do the dress pattern. But I didn't see the detail up top of um, C. And I like that. And I feel like this is like a perfect fall look. Like, um, the next product, moving on. Well, this one I picked up by accident. Yeah, so I didn't realize that it was a youth pattern. Um, so... I probably can do the the plus size like the 14 to 16 and it probably still fit me because I'm I'm very small so I probably can still use it and this one is a toddler pattern I did not pick this one up by accident I bought this one um to make a dress for my daughter I like to make her um like matching clothes for me and her so I'm most definitely going to um, dive into this one and make something for her. And this one is because R11495. Pattern for this one is because R11553. It has um long sleeve or the short sleeves option with a tie in the back. See, I didn't even realize that it was crisscross in the back. Yeah, this one is very nice. Yeah, so that was my recent um, visit to Joanne's Fabric Store. I got me some goodies. I'm so excited to dive in. Um, I just decided to just share with you guys my plans for the sewing for the month. Let me know if you guys would like to see more of these videos of my pickups from Joanne's. I'm more than happy to share them with you guys. Make sure that you are following me on my sewing page, which is That So Leaker, and my personal page, which I style all the stuff that I make, which is Leaker J. So follow me on Instagram. Uh, make sure you are subscribed here. And then I'll see you in the next one. Bye.